1983 Ford Fiesta XR2 Rolls Royce Silver Shadow 1979 Welcome back to the channel This week's video we're down at the um, It's called the Great British Car Journey It's situated just on the A6 between uh, Belper and Matlock um, So if you're a car enthusiast especially old cars then you might enjoy this one so I'll run there uh, have a look around and see what's like what's that say so it basically tells the story of the UK motor industry from the 30s onwards through these nine chapters um, it's quite a few cars with low mileages. The Victor there's done 87 miles from new. God. So that's not done 100 yet. Um, well, that's so mad, isn't it? Uh, I've got a Mini with four and a half miles that's never been on the road. And what's that worth? I don't know. It's one of the last ones built, and the lady um, had one already. And she loved Minis, and she thought she was going to replace it with a new one, but in the end she just kept on with her existing one and put this in the garage and never used it. So it's unregistered, so it's got cellophane on the seats, there's stickers in the windows from the factory, that's radio worth, areas in a packet not used. That, that's worth thousands. It would be, yes. Yeah. The chap who owned it, he died in his 90s a couple of years ago. The family never knew he owned it, so it's only when they cleared his no stuff. Way. Because he had two, he had a blue one as well. No air conditioning on that one. Nineteen thirty one. Nineteen thirty one Austin. Another Austin. This is a 1947 Austin Woody. Never heard of it. Before my time. Yeah, it is. Is this an Austin 7 here then? Same as that one over there. Look at I mean, look at controls on that inside. Oh, the min dash in that. Unbelievable. Imagine getting up on a cold morning having to do that. I think that might be indicator. I think that might slide out, pop out as an indicator. I might be wrong. Gosh, a bit of luxury there. Morris Martin, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's lilac. Morris Martin. It said on here that the uh, Willie Morris, he um, 
gambled his whole fortune on this, on my, minus minor. Paid off, didn't it? And how many of the souls? Millions. Oh yeah. Wouldn't like to put a price tag on this one, would you? I don't even know what I don't even know what, what this is. Okay. I don't even know what this is. Does it tell you there? <laughs> is it a national <laughs> metropolitan? Is that the name of the car then? Yeah, it must be. National yeah. Nineteen fifty eight, yeah. This is the Rover P6 V8, 1973. And a dodgy brine colour. I remember uh, my brother-in-law, yeah, I did a blue one of these. So I'm sure he'll be interested to see this. Automatic. There's a manual choke on that. No automatic choke. Them days. And it's done. 52,000 miles. It has an 8 track stereo inside and a V8 engine. Whatever 8 track is. <laughs> Here we have a 1982 Morris Ital. <laughs> yeah, definitely eight is trimming there. Austin Maxi, oh yeah, my dad definitely had one of these, a blue one. To be fair, this was, I remember my dad had one of these for 500 quid. He bought it from his mate that worked at Stone's Garage at Belper. And he had it about six years. Right, yeah, I remember it. I remember it well. And I think this is, this is a TR6. It's in good condition. Well, they all are to be fair. Is it TR? Yep, 1973. 1973. Well, this one here is one of the last ever minis made. Old lady had it, and that cellophane has never been off. Some 
is over here. It's a 1963 Mini 850 Deluxe. You've got the old uh, picnic, picnic thing. The gear stick. Still got all the cellophane on the seats. I've got a 1965 Mini Traveller. This is a Mini Clubman 1979. This is the 30th anniversary 1989 Mini. Have a quick look inside here. Oh, it smells brand new. How can it smell brand new after all that time? Amazing. Lovely interior. That's worth a fortune. And behind me here we've got the classic Mark 1 Escort. Let's have a look from the front and have a look inside it. This is a 1972. Seventy-two. I don't know how many of you had one of these. I bet you, bet you wish you got this one now. That must be worth thousands. Original condition. Thirteen hundred GT. Lovely that is. Right, we'll move on. We have a Rover Vitesse 1986. I remember I'm using these as police cars. Spoil around back. TR7. 1980. Used to see these flying about on the streets. 19,000 mile. 19,000 mile. Nothing. Two litre Mini Macro. Nineteen eighty one. This has got less than ten thousand miles on clock. We're all familiar with the cheese wedge. How dare you? Austin Princess. I don't know how popular these were, but they weren't a great looking car. That's just my opinion, obviously. But uh, I bet there's a few that agree with me. Never seen this other one before. 
typical era though, isn't it? It's quite comfy seeing it back in the day. Martin H3, Ford Fiesta XR2, one of the hot hatchbacks at the time. I remember these old pepper pots. Metro and a Maestro. I think Maestro was a prone to rust in back in the day. 1989. I was never a fan of these. Let's have a look now. I'm sure if anybody owns one, they want to have a quick look. Smiley on this one. 13,000 miles. 13,000 miles. Jesus. Nothing. Don't wear some macular. And everybody knows what this one is, don't we? famous rather than 1985 film Back to the Future let's see if we can find flux capacity nope it's fluxed off <laughs> basically that is entire, isn't it basically that is entire isn't it Here we've got a Daimler. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Nineteen eighty eight Daimler Limousine Rolls Royce Silver Shadow nineteen seventy nine. Smell it. Mm. Smell it. It's like an old book. Old book. Yeah, you open the book. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Sale. How much is it? I don't know. What's it say? Have you seen mileage on some of these? They're like the odd than any of them. The one I've just looked at over there, can't remember which one it was now. It's only done 13,000. Oh, that, uh, I 
I think it was that, you know, that blue, that blue one, that blue one over there, that blue uh, Maestro. Yeah. That's right, I've done 13,000 miles. Here we have the uh, Ford Capri, 1988. Last taxed in uh, 2015. I never had one of these. Buckets eats in it. Two point eight injection. Popular car. <laughs> 